capitalist system does not guarantee or take responsibility for sustaining life and leads to the breakdown of community and collective relationships. It transfers this responsibility to households, making it individual and isolated. Feminist economics focuses on the role of the community in combating the isolation imposed upon us as a result of life being used to serve capital. We understand communities as spaces shaped by dynamics of solidarity, free from assistentialism and patronage, where solutions are generated collectively. How can we strengthen existing communities? How can we build communities in places where people have already forgotten the meaning of the word? How can we do so while maintaining a critical vision? Potential solutions include decentralized production, social and solidarity economy cooperatives and care networks for the elderly. Everyone needs care and it is essential that we care for one another in an egalitarian manner. Care is directly connected to households. We often hear that women are returning to the home because they have lost their jobs or because their jobs have been pushed into the home by remote working. Yet, the reality is that women have never stopped being at home. The responsibility of domestic and care work has always fallen to women. Instead of generating resources to tackle this problem, the system opts for an increasingly privatized state where public services are replaced by market services, available only to a minority. How could this situation be reversed? By developing a state that uses horizontal and democratic co-management to reinforce communitarian practices based on non-market dynamics that guarantee the sustainability of life. In order to change the capitalist system, we must adopt a critical vision looking both inward and outward. We must look inward to address the sexist, racist and classist dynamics occurring within the community and outward to collectivize individual problems. Feminist economics calls for the elements that are essential for the common good to be prioritized over the interests of the markets.